guys, what's going on? Russ here. Today I've got a video entry into Comic Head 84's 200 subscriber contest. And what he's looking for is three of uh, three of his favorite characters, Batman, X-Men, and Silver Surfer, or Galactus. And he wants you to find three of your favorite books in those series and show them off and say why they're your favorites. Now, um, I'll leave a link to his uh, giveaway video in the description below, so you guys can go check it out and see what the giveaway is for. And uh, there's two ways to enter. You can leave a, a, a comment or do a video entry, but the, uh, they don't stack together. It's, it's one or the other. Uh, and the books for X-Men. Now... I don't have a whole lot of X-Men in my collection anymore. I'm still sort of rebuilding my collection from the ones I had to sell off like years and years ago. But this is uh, X-Men, Uncanny X-Men 304. And the reason I'm picking this one is because it was just, as a kid, overall, this Fatal Attraction storyline was one of my favorites. And, uh... If I remember right, it's the storyline that got me into X-Men comic books. Because I started out as DC with Superman. And I was that for years. But I saw these Fatal Attraction issues. It's got a cool wraparound cover. And the storyline was just fantastic. I won't spoil anything, but I'm sure that most of you know what it is and have read it. Yeah, that is my pick for X-Men. And again, I don't have a lot of Fantastic Four. I mean, Fantastic Four. Silver Surfer. Because I didn't read a lot of Silver Surfer coming up. I only have two issues. But this, I remember reading this one. And it just stood out as an awesome story. And I believe it's the lead up to Infinity Gauntlet, if I'm not mistaken. But for whatever reason, I never really picked up any more Silver Surfer. And I believe... Let me see. Yeah, this was the lead up to the Infinity Gauntlet story. And there is a... Galactus, yeah, there's the Galactus appearance in the book. So hopefully that that one counts. And yet again with Batman, I had a ton of Batman in my collection back in the day. And if I still had it, I probably would have picked uh, one of the Nightfall storyline books because that was... My favorite Batman story back in the day. But what I do have is my current favorite Batman story going on. Well, this one is a one-shot, but it's the Batman who laughs. This was the Dark Knight Metals. I do have the first issue of the six-issue miniseries that's out now. But I haven't picked up issue two yet. But anyway... I'm going with this as my current favorite Batman story. Because this story just, I don't know, it just blew me away. But again, I'm sure most of you have probably read this. And that sticks out as my current favorite Batman since I no longer have the Nightfall issues on hand. I, um, hopefully I covered everything. Guys, that will do it for this one. And I'll catch you in the next one. Peace, everybody.